Welcome to the CPSC product registry training video. This video will demonstrate how to edit an existing product certificate. Please note that the CPSC product registry is an ongoing development. Features and functionality are subject to change. Business account administrators can edit data in any product collection. Collection administrators and collection editors can only edit product certificate data within their assigned product collections. If the product certificate has been certified, users have a 48-hour editing grace period to edit product certificate details without having to create a new version. Please note that the exact duration of this grace period is subject to change. If a product certificate has been certified for longer than the 48-hour grace period, or has been used in a reference PGA message set within the 48-hour grace period, users must create a new version of the completed product certificate with a new version ID. Refer to the video titled, Create New Version for Certified Product Certificates to learn more. The option to edit will only be visible when a 48-hour grace period is active or when the current certificate version has a status of incomplete or awaiting certification. Please note that if edits are made within the 48-hour editing grace period after certification, the product certificate will need to be recertified. Upon recertification, the 48-hour editing grace period will restart. From the e-filing dashboard, navigate to the Product Collection section. Click the Product Collection that stores the applicable product certificates you would like to edit. Within the Product Collection, navigate to the product certificate that you would like to edit that is either incomplete, awaiting certification, or within its 48-hour editing grace period. Under the Action column for that product certificate, click the three-dot icon to view a drop-down menu. Click Edit from the drop-down menu. The Product Data Entry window will appear to edit product details. It is important to note that users can edit all certificate data elements except the primary product ID. Refer to the video titled, Manually Enter a Single Product Certificate to view step-by-step -step instructions for how to enter data in this window. For this demo, we will add some data under the Testing tab. Once the edits have been made, and you've reached the final certification screen, the user can click Certify or Submit for Certification based on whether they have permission to certify. Note that by certifying, the user is attesting or certifying that the finished product covered by the certificate complies with the stated rules, bans, standards, and regulations, and that all data provided in the certificate is true and accurate to the best of their knowledge. Once the edited entry has been completed, you'll receive a message that notifies you that your product certificate has been updated successfully. Note that once a product certificate has been edited and certified or recertified, the 48-hour editing grace period will begin again. As noted by the clock icon that appears under the status column, you have 48 hours to edit the entry again without having to create a new version. This concludes our demonstration of how to edit an existing product certificate. If you have additional questions, visit cpsc.gov forward slash e-filing or email e-filing support at cpsc.gov for assistance.